Hello. Hi. Hey, boo. What's your name? Hi, my name is Dana. Dana, where you calling me from? Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia. What you do for a living, Dana? I am a licensed hairstylist, and I am the owner of Six Sense of Beauty and Cosmetics. Oh, you came on for a full commercial. Well, I, <laughs> I didn't know you was going to pick me because some other girls was on. So okay. I, was, I was about to get off and get do a TikTok. Ah, oh, okay. Well, get in the middle of... Yeah, we got to see your face, baby. Oh, All yeah. right, so Dana, Lance, oh, let, me turn, let me turn the lights on so they can get brighter. Okay. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you own your own. Um, what is what is it? This is a hair and skincare line. It's a natural okay. skincare line. Okay, hair and skincare. You have any kids? No. No kids. How old are you, boo? I'm 37. 37. Dana Atlanta, 37, owns her own hair and skincare line. Um, 37, no kids. What's your birthday, or Zodiac sign? Um, Aquarius, February 5th. Aquarius. All right, bro. What kind of man you looking for? Um, someone that's like laid back, chill. I have a big personality, so they can't really have a big personality. <laughs> Cause I feel like I'm too much, so they need to be a little bit more. What are you looking at? <laughs> My dog. She just running around over there. She got home back now. Okay, make sure. Okay, look at us, honey. All right, so they have a big, you said they can or cannot have a big personality. Yeah, just like more calm and mellow because I have a big personality. So I think that'll be too much. All right, what's some deal breakers? Um, deal breaker, um, still going through some stuff with their um, previous girlfriend, like or marriage. I don't want anybody that's going through a divorce and needs to already be divorced. Um, also, I don't want like a guy with a lot of kids. Because I don't have kids, so I don't want a guy with a lot of kids. Do you want Do you want kids? I want kids, just one. But... Just one kid. Okay. <laughs> um, and he can have how many kids? Um, I do two. Two I kids. Know. Two. Like one two? of the pop, like one. May, I really prefer one, but I do two. Two. All right. This is Dana Atlanta. Um, no kids, 37 Aquarius. Does he got to look a certain way? Um, I like red bones. <laughs> I like black guys. I like white conflicted, but I take a chocolate, but like, it really doesn't matter. Long as he treat me good. Okay. All right. Does he got to make a certain amount of money? Um, I don't, as long as he can take care of himself. Well, no, no, no. You got to be able to take care of yourself and me. Because if you make just enough to take care of yourself and then you end up losing your job, then yeah. Yeah, at least, at least, I want to say six figures. I prefer six figures because I make six figures, but, like, um, I could do 75. I could do 75K and up. 75K and, and up. I'll say I'll do 75,000 with, with, like, a dream that you're working towards. I could do that. Oh, so 75K mm -hmm. with potential. Yeah, like, you working towards, like, owning, if you're a truck driver, you working towards owning your own truck company. Like, you can't just be want to drive forever. You got to be able to, like, want more, you know? Got you. All right, boo, let's see the Kendra cam. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> okay, we see you. Ooh, got body, got booty. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay, so when was your last relationship? Um, About two months ago. Two months ago, okay. You don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask, when's the last time you was intimate with someone? Um, two months ago. <laughs> two months ago. Okay. Is that guy an option? Um, no, he's not. No, he was going through too much. He was going, he was going through a lot. Oh, and oh, and I don't, I don't, if you're an alcoholic, I don't want you. Because that was the reason why me and him didn't last. Because he had a real bad alcohol problem. And when he's like up under the influence, like he was real like mean. So... Like, if you're going to drink, drink, like, casually. It can't be something that you're doing, like, every day. Like, no. Okay. But, yeah. Got you. All right. So, let's do it. This is Dana Atlanta mm -hmm. Hair and Skin um, product. She has no kids. She wants one kid. And she's an Aquarius. Why do you think you're single? Um, I'm single because, for some reason, I keep attracting guys that's going through something. I know we all go through stuff. But for some reason, I just keep attracting guys. That's like, either I don't have 
have a car or they just walk to a job or they don't have nowhere to stay. It's just, and then I live in Atlanta. So in Atlanta, it's almost like you, you, you tend to run to people who run into a lot of people who pretend that they have this nice life on social media. And when you meet them, they are, they don't have nothing. So, and then I no longer like them. Then I, I don't like them no more today. After I find out you don't lie about your life, it kind of like made me not like you no more. So, yeah, I don't like, I don't want to take care of no man. And I feel like I keep attracting guys who like watch my life through social media and they want to be a part of it so much. And then they get in my life and then they be jealous. They be like trying to shit on me all the time. Like, oh, your business this, your business that. And I'm like, damn, you know? So it's just like, like now I'm just looking for something a little bit more different. I don't want to look for someone who's like, you can't like lead me if you need me, you know? You can't leave me if you need me. No, you can't leave. That means I can't follow you if you need me. I want to. I want a man that I can follow. I want a man that I can submit to, I can look up to. If you don't have a vision, I don't care about the plan, but if you don't have a vision for your future, your own future and your family moving forward, then you really can't do too much with me. And then I don't want a man that need me. Because if you need me, then you cannot leave. So are you saying need you financially? Like need me like... You don't have a car, or you lied about a car. Like, the, like one time I got met a guy. He told me that his car was in the shop. Well, two years later, the car still was in the shop. Like, I don't know. So I just don't want nobody who I like, need my help. Like, you know what I'm saying? I see what you're saying. I would challenge that slightly because a lot of um, powerful men are, you know, they are they are the person that is that is the face, but they they give their wives a lot of credit. You know, like, they'll say, like, my wife, I needed my wife for this. And I think, like, the Michelle and Barack Obama story, that was what I first thought about in the beginning. Now, Barack had his own car. But if you know their story, Michelle was the the breadwinner on top kind of at first. And then, obviously, he became the president of the United States. And now she's, you know, now the rest is history. But don't negate what you can offer and think that the man still can't lead in the process. Yeah, I just don't really want him to come. I don't want to meet them already, like, I'm just saying, no. Like, I don't want to meet you already broke, no job, no nothing. Just looking to leech. And then, I don't, I don't, I don't want that. Like, no. I mean, I understand the Barack story, but, you know, everybody, everybody ain't chill. So, I, I don't know if I want to. <laughs> everybody ain't Michelle, baby. Uh-uh. No. So, so do, you love, do, you, do you know, Um. okay, fair enough, fair enough. Do you have a lot of married, do you want to get married? Yeah, I, I would love to get married. And I don't mind helping my husband, but I'm just saying, I don't want to meet you already helping me. But I'm just saying, like, I don't want to meet you already helping you. You know? Like, I don't want to be building you up. Like, you need to be already something. Yeah, I get it. You don't want, they're saying a bum. You don't want a guy I don't want to take care of you. I don't want to take care of you. I don't want to, like, you, no, you can't hold my car. No, no, I'm not picking you up from your job every day. Like, no, no I get that. I my home. We get okay. that. We get that. So, <laughs> no, she's not. You, you cannot borrow her car. She's not picking you up from your job. Um, she's not going to babysit your kids while you're at work. No. <laughs> I stood out without that. I knew you was going to agree to it. <laughs> no, I love the kids. No, I love the kids. I keep the kids. I keep the kids because I love kids. But, yeah, just meet and, like, help me out. Like, come on with something. Like, don't just come with nothing. Okay. All right, boom. So, and why would a guy be lucky? Did I ask you that question? Why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Um, I feel like a guy would be lucky to have me because, like, um, not even because I'm successful. I'm going to take all this success, act like that doesn't even exist. I'm a nurturer. I cater to my men. Like, I love in a different way. And it doesn't always have to come with material stuff. Like, I like to, uh, like, I like to, uh, like, uplift a guy, uplift anybody, anybody around me. I like for them to feel good about themselves. Like, you know, like, if you feel feeling less, it's my job to make you feel like you're more than what you are, you know? So I feel like, I'm, I think I'm a, I think that I will be a good catch for someone, like. She says she will be a good catch. Let's do it. This is Dana Atlanta, ATL. Does he got to be in Atlanta? Huh? No, it don't have to be Atlanta. Okay. What's the age range you want to date? You're 37. Um, like, 30, I do, like, 36. I would do one year, one year younger, 36 to, like, 40. 36 to 40? Mm-hmm. Okay, 36 to 40. All right, boo, give them your Instagram page. My Instagram is the Midnight Diva. It's T-H-E, Midnight, M-I-D-N-I-G-H-T, Diva.
D I V A. The Midnight Diva, T H E M I D N I G H T D I V A. The Midnight Diva. Yeah. All right, Dana, honey. Bye. Okay. <laughs> Bye, boo.